here we are on my screen. You're going to go to mobilemonkey.com. Um, pretty straightforward. And here's a landing page. There's a webinar um, that is always starting in a few minutes if you'd like to watch that. But let's just go ahead right away and log in. So there's no register button, right? You're just going to always just log in using here in the top right hand corner of the screen of the menu. And you're going to be prompted to log in, sign in with Facebook, or you can sign in with an email. It's so much easier to sign in with your Facebook account because then everything's going to be um, integrated very easily. So you don't need to create a separate account. We're going to click sign in with Facebook. And I'm going to go ahead and type in my um, burner email address I made for this. Mobile Monkey 1212. And log in. Okay, the next page that you get to is Welcome to Mobile Monkey. And if you have Facebook pages created, like a personal page for a public figure or your business page, then those will be populated right here. But let's say you don't have a Facebook let's say you don't have a Facebook page created for your business yet. So let's quickly walk through and do that now. So we're going to go over to create a page. We're going to let's say call it a business or a brand. We're going to name our page and we're going to, we're going to call it um, Isaac's Awesome Art Supplies. I used to be an artist. Still am, but don't get any time to paint anymore. Category, let's see, is art, artist, or art, let's say. Um, it's really, maybe we'll, since, it's, since we're going to pretend that it's an e-commerce, hmm, let's see, or let's say call it retail. All right, we're going to call it retail company, okay? You just find the, find the proper um, category for your business, continue. And we're going to add a profile picture. So I'm going to go. By the way, if you guys ever never been, if you've never been to unsplash.com, awesome resource for all types of fantastic images, um, and it's free. All these use, all these images are free. So, oh, here's a nice image for my art supplies. I'm going to download for free, and I'm going to upload a profile picture. Might be too big. I might have to resize it. Oh, that's you know my. This I wanted this to be my cover photo, but we'll upload a profile picture later. So now I have my cover photo, which is the big one, and they're going to ask us to put in um, some. Okay, so I don't the cover photo didn't work, but I have the. Okay. So now we have a Facebook page and that's basically it straight up. I mean, we could add obviously a lot of information about our page, um, modify all the settings of the page. Um, there's a lot we could do, but again, this is not a course about setting up a Facebook business page. If you do have any questions, then definitely post it in the Mobile Monkey Facebook community and uh, people will be more than happy to help you. Uh, we could add a short description, but let's go back to Mobile Monkey and see what we have here, okay? So once I've refreshed Mobile Monkey, as long as I'm still signed into Facebook, it'll show that I have the page. I'm going to click connect to connect my page. And you guys could connect whatever pages that you want to connect. If you're an agency, you're going to have a lot of different pages that you could connect. And just connecting the page doesn't mean that you've activated any sort of chatbot. Now we're going to finish our sign up with Mobile Monkey. I'm going to call myself an agency, or in this case, I'd be a marketer. Monthly Facebook ad spend, choose your monthly Facebook ad spend. My business address is um, for this page, Mobile Monkey 1212. Website is RodanskyArt.com. I think that I think that's actually still active. That website you can check it out. Phone number um, complete account. Continue as Larry White. That's my fake name for this mobile account. Okay, and this is the this welcome screen that you're going to see whenever you log into a Mobile Monkey account. And if you have one connected page, you'll see one connected page. And if you have a lot of different connected pages, you'll have a lot of different connected pages. And you'll see a basic overview of how your pages are performing with regards to your chatbot. So total number of contacts, new, um, number of new contacts this week, 
end sessions this week. And I'll show you what that looks like in a live format. I have a few different mobile monkey accounts. One of them is being used for this course. I have a few different sample pages I've connected. Um, and there's one actually active bot. I have, I do have permission from the, from the client, uh, to, go through this bot and show, the, show, show some results and things like that. So if you look at this bot down here that says Sofamania, you'll see 1182 total contacts, 13 new contacts this week, and 33, um, we're down 33 sessions this week from the week prior.